morning guys um, as you can see we've got all the treatments out again a load of our fish have got us ulcers really bad ulcers um, we've lost one and we think we might lose another but there's quite a few of them that have got ulcers this, this is the worst one. How long have we had this one? A couple of weeks. What the fish? Oh, this one you bought. Yeah, we got say. you got from September last last year from Detling. So this one I bought in at Detling last year, so it's really come along well. Vince, don't know what it's called, what sort it is. Let us know <laughs> you, as usual. But we're hoping we can save them. But we've tried absolutely everything now. And we just don't know what to do, really. Mm. Yeah, my uh, el elderberry, the uh, sambuca, is uh, losing its leaves. So I get my elderberry pond every year. <laughs> Goldfish don't make seem to mind. Right, I'm just waiting for this one to sedate, sedate and then I'm gonna treat him. Him, her, not sure. Oh. I wish we had a measuring bowl. Oh, he's on his way. tried everything with the pond, I just don't know. We treated for flukes, we've PP'd, we've done big water change, we've put salt in. I just I think we're at a loss at the minute. We just there's so many of them have got ulcers that are getting worse. We just don't know. I think I know what it is, it's just that uh, I've got to try and uh, sort the uh, line around. I've got some, I think there's three, mm -hmm. three creases in it, and every time I look, mm -hmm. it's covered in detritus, fish poo, mm -hmm. everything. It's just a question of... <laughs> Nosy those, neighbour. Um, what not things, isn't it? The things we have to do to stop them from trying to climb over the fence. I know, how ridiculous is that? Nosy neighbour he is. Looks like he's... Slowly. Yeah. The, the he's a nice looking fish though. Mm. The ulcer is healing slowly. Is that one I bought or, or one I was given? That's the one you was... bought. Okay. Believe it or not, yours is twice the size. Mm. It's one that I, I bought at Detling mm. last September. He's destroying your uh, plant. Mm. <laughs> Shout out to James, because you'll have you've had problems as well. James the Koi Whisperer. Standing on your palms. <laughs> Vince, keep your keep your chin up, mate. You look a bit rough recently. Don't you look tired? 
probably fed up with things, same as us. But we've got to keep going, keep trodding on. Trodding on, I should say. Take it easy. And I think this he's gone, Mick. Mark. Mm -hmm. Ollie causing chaos. What are you doing, Ollie? Anything he wants to. <laughs> mm, let's have a look at this old subject. Mark, do you want to take cameras? Okay. No, because my hands are wet, dear. I guess I'll have a closer look at the old subject. It's not as bad as it was. Mm. Oh, excuse me. Like uh, some of the other channels, we're trying to be open about what's going on with our fish. This has all just happened recently, really. All these ulcers. We had one or two in the past, but this is really bad at the minute. Uh, it's not nice when you start to lose the fish. We've had them out several times yeah. to treat them. Come on. As well as treating the water. As I say, we've done everything we can. We think that there's, it might be the liner. We may need to either straighten the liner out because it's gathering fish poop, basically, at the bottom. Or may, may need to change things completely next year. I don't know. Um. Are there any more that need treating, Mark? No. No? No, I've done that this morning. Okay. This is the one. So how many have you done that so far? How many have got ulcers that you've found? Four. Four? Mm. How, mu how much worse are the other ones than this one? Got one, my favourite is really bad, but. And what's your favourite one? The height suey. So, height suey's got a really bad ulcer, Mark said. The height suey or the kid suey? Oh, the orange and black. Always. Get them wrong. the ulcer swab. I've got the um, propolis. Oh, I'll come away. All adhesives powder mm. from rinse. Mm. But this antibac I've seen James using mm. and a few others. So now ulcer seems to heal up. So that uh, antibac. Mm. And the kasuri came this morning, hence getting this one out. Uh, none of them are flicking or flashing. Mm. So, well, they shouldn't be really with the treatments they've had. <laughs> I mean, I've even done DB4, DB4, is DB4 tablets for the chlorine. Mm. I've even done those and mm. it, it stays clear, so 
it's not chlorine down in the pond. And there he goes. I've got some more aquaflavin which I'm going to put in the pond in a minute. Hmm. I just wish we could sort it out, I really do. holding too much detritus mm. as when I do the uh, did a PP a couple of weeks ago it went purple for for a couple of hours mm. even with the uh, Ollie Ollie Oi. Oh, it's a sad. Let's have a look at these. Let's see if we can see them. them are doing okay they're doing what they're doing well but it's just we seem to be having this ulcer problem and I think next year we're gonna have to uh, rethink the pond so I was thinking well Vince has offered to come up mm. and give me hand to empty the pond out mm. Thank you, Vince. It's really kind of you. Uh, if I can get a paddling pool and set it up on the patio back there, I'll get the fish out sooner. Mm. But I was going to put them all in the IBC, mm. but I think I've, there's too many to go in there. So. Yeah. What's people's opinions? I've got a 20,000 pressure filter. Because my pump is in the bottom of the pond and it picks up algae, poo, fish waste, dead waste food. I'm thinking of putting that onto the baffy shower first. So it'll go through the sponges clean the fill, clean the spon sponges will clean the water before it goes into the back of the shower. Mm. We need to get it sorted don't we because otherwise we're going to lose them. Mm. I'm doing that. Uh, I'll chuck some more aquaflavin in mm. in a second. So I've got an asadi down there which has got an old, old it's top fin, you won't see it's gone over the other side. Mm. Top fin's losing some of it. So the, but when I do the water parameters, pH is around 8, kh is okay, about 10. Nitrite is down low, 0, 0 0.5 at most. 
nitrates. It's just strange how it affects some of the koi and not all of them. What treatments have we used so far? No, we've used salt. Ooh. <laughs> Growling out little sod. Next door's cat, I think. I love it when they do a swim bar. I love them doing swim bars. Yeah, salt is, has, has been 0 0.07 for a couple of weeks. Drain that out. Did a big 50% water change. Pee peaked the pond, but that only lasted two, three hours, I think it was. Mm before it changed again. So yeah, to get a bit closer. Okay. What other treatments have you done? Tell you something I've, I notice because I've not been out here for a couple of weeks because I've had a couple of falls and hurt my leg. They thought my leg was broken, but it, um, it looks like it's just soft tissue so damage. Soft 0.6, 0.7, EP. Mm -hmm. Flute. Yep. Actual flowering, FNP. So basically we've covered all the parasites that we can think of. That's why I say it's, mm. it's got to be that line up where I was putting it in on my own. Because mm. I had no one else to help me at the time. Goromo's doing well. Yeah, it's strange, some of them are doing really, really well. Mm. It's one thing I noticed when I've not been out here for a couple of weeks, like I was saying, I hurt my leg. Um, but I've noticed when I come out after a couple of weeks, I notice the difference in size in some of them. So, Tango, the big orange one, mm -hmm. had him out a couple of, well, last month. Mm. Because I had a few people saying that he's got egg bound or mm. she's egg bound. Mm. Uh, we're, we're pretty sure it's a tumour. Yeah. Mm. And, uh, got, got her out or him out and tried doing what they said, gently squeezing to see if any eggs or anything comes out. Mm. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. No, we did try. But... Mm. But she's, I mean, we've had her a while now and she's doing okay. Yeah, we've given, given them. All the time she's happy, I'll, we'll leave her there. I'm not going to... I'm not going to euthanise her just because she's got a tumour. If, if she starts to suffer, then we will. Right. <laughs> This one here, I don't know if you can pick it up, that one that's just going that way, the white's got a bit of orange on the sides, yeah. it's actually got its gill plate, this on its left side, mm. missing completely, yeah. yet it's got no ulcer, no flick, nothing, and it's, it's surviving. Mm. Mm. I do love our fish. Koi, they're just so diverse in their colours. I just love it. We do need to move some on. No, I can't, as I've said I can't before. Get, can't get but, the but while they've got ulcers, we can't. We just no, well, no, we can't do it at all. So.
as one or two of you have seen on Facebook, I've been doing my crafting recently, doing my clay work. Um, I've done a koi, which I will I'll post a picture on here. got to varnish it yet. Mm. So I'll just put my hand inside the uh, nexus mm. to see if I can feel any detritus in there. Mm. I mean, we have got some beautiful fish in there, you know. Some lovely koi. Mm. There's old piggy down there. Alright guys, I think that's all for this week. Um, we'll try and get videos out more often. We've been taking a break on purpose to be fair. But, um, Stop falling out your wheelchair. Yes, I have. Yes, that's how I hurt my leg. I've, been, I've, been, I've had a couple of falls um, transferring and I fell out of the wheelchair. So, yeah, I've been struggling a bit recently. Take it, been taking it easy, so we'll try and get some more videos out, especially while it's not too cold out here. But, yep, yeah, okay, guys, so I hope everyone's well. As I say, Vince, cheer up, take it easy. I also think I've found out another reason why they might be getting ulcers. Mm -hmm. We have Mises. Oh yes, we do. We have mice at the back of the pond, at the back of the uh, along all the way along the fence here. Uh, yeah. Caught, caught one of them in the pond drinking and nicking the bloody food. Here's another one of my creations, guys. Do you like it? Oh, which one? The orange and black core or the sign? The back. The sign. Yeah, the fair. black. You didn't offer that, did you? Oh, yeah, I did. I saw you doing it yesterday. Yeah, yeah. I think it looks alright. Okay, guys, yes, we are going this time. Right, take care, everyone. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the videos coming, everyone. We do watch them, as many as we possibly can. Now, I've got to do your pond as well next. Mm. Take care. Bye.